What's going down, Ravens? I'm Hayden Fletcher. I hope you're all having a wonderful day, and I'm also not supposed to be hosting this show, but it's a last-minute compromise. Let's get right into the news. Our very own Raven football team won their very first game of the season. They managed to take down Shawnee Mission Northwest on Friday, due in part to an impressive touchdown run from Andrew Dumas. Several big plays from Gabe Barfity and some physical runs by Cole Manning. They walked away victorious over the Cougars 29-21. Congrats on the big win, boys. And a reminder that this week, ONW Football will be selling Think Pink gear during Raven 50. Come and buy some pink Raven spirit wear to support our football team and breast cancer awareness. And remember to wear them to the Pink Out game on Friday. The Lady Raven tennis team competed for state placement last Saturday. The doubles teams, Mattingly and Brown, along with Boudreaux and Castillo, both lost in the first round to tough teams. Andreessen had a great match in her play-in round, but lost her match in the first round of the tournament. Sydney lost a close match in the first round as well. You'll get it next year, ladies. Brooke Elam had a successful day this past Saturday. She finished 6th place on the floor, 5th place on beam, 4th place on bars, and 3rd place all around. Way to go, Brooke. Don't forget to come out Olathe East tonight at 6 p.m. to support our Raven JV and Varsity Volleyball teams for the annual Dig Pink Volleyball Tournament. Last night, the volleyball teams rallied at the Olathe Community Center for a dinner to prepare for the big day. Dig Pink raises awareness for breast cancer and brings all the Olathe High Schools together for a great cause. What a recap, Ravens. I hope you have a splendid rest of your day. I know I will. Peace out, home skillets. Also, Katie Parks was supposed to read that line, so don't blame me. All right, bye.